So here we have pilots and we are working on pilots leash walking today. Nice lure leash walking to my left side. We only walk on the left side. Come. Good boy. Good boy. We want to keep the extra positive, very positive reinforcements, um, even correction. So I have do have a martingale collar on him. It's okay. Um, just that way he, if he pulls, he does get kind of just a little bit of pressure. I'm not using a slip just because I want to keep it positive. So just that Martin collar, martingale collar where it only has just that little bit of tension right there. And when he doesn't pull, he gets that release. So I'm lure leash walking right to my left side. Good boy. Uh -uh. If he jumps, I'm telling him, uh-uh. Good. This way. Telling him this way when we're changing direction. Uh-uh. This way. Good boy. Easy. And I'm also teaching him easy to be easy with that treat just because he does, uh-uh. So if he walks out in front of me, I'm gonna tell him, uh-uh. This way. Good boy. Good boy. So he does seem to be mouthing and we've just been um, correcting that with just either telling him uh-uh and if he continues to do it, just that subtle little chin chop. This way. Pilot. Good boy. Good boy. This way. Telling him this way when we change direction. Good boy. This way. Come on. Good boy. Easy. Good. Not rewarding him if he is jumping on us. And if he does jump, pilot, hi. Good boy. I want him to greet me. Nice sitting down. I don't want him jumping on me. And if he were to jump, I just say, uh-uh, give that knee and telling him off. Pilot, this way. Good, uh-uh, this way. Uh-uh, good. Good boy. This way. for him to come back to me. Uh -uh. If he's pulling, I'm also going to do the same thing. Waiting for that slack for him to come back to my left side. Good. Good boy. Uh -uh. So just telling him, uh -uh, uh -uh. off. So like I said, giving that gentle knee, just telling him off. Uh -uh. Sees other people walking by, wants to go say hi. Hi, look. Good. I want his focus to stay on me. So if someone walks by, I still want him to be focused on me. So just by telling him, just by calling his name. Pilot, good. This way. Come on, Pilot. Good boy. Good boy. Uh -uh. Easy. Good boy. When he gets that, uh uh. So like I said, he is trying to mouth me. Uh uh. So just kind of just um giving him that chin chop right on the mouth. I'll come up a little closer so I can show you how to do that. Especially when he comes home, you want to make sure you reinforce that so he isn't mouthing you. And when you are trying to do training, he's not trying to bite your hand almost. Uh uh. Good boy. Uh uh. So any kind of mouthing at all. Uh uh. So I don't want him to think my hand is that reward. Uh uh. Good boy. And when he's nice and gentle, that's when I'm going to give him that treat. So I'm going to teach you easy really quick in this video as well. Pilot, can you sit? I want to make sure. Come, sit. Easy. Uh-uh. Easy. Uh-uh. So if he's trying to be really hard with his mouth, easy. Uh-uh. Easy. Good boy. Pilot, sit. Easy. Nice and gentle. I don't really care if he's um, coming in or trying to just nibble at just the treat or almost like nibble with just his lips. I don't want any teeth. Easy. Good boy. And making him almost wait until he's being gentle. Easy. Uh-uh. Easy. Uh-uh. Easy. Good boy. Good boy, pilot. So we're gonna do a quick sit and a down. Pilot, come. Sit. Yes. Down. So this is what we also have been working on. So waiting for him to lay down, no lure. Hey, sit. Down. 
Good boy. Good boy. I don't want to lure. I want to only be able to do it with one hand. Pilot, come. Sit. Good. Pilot, down. practicing it from standing up but sometimes being out in a new environment this is totally new for him I want to try it in a new spot um, are you okay? yes, upside down. but because it's in a new environment sometimes it takes a little bit to practice so we're gonna try it one more time maybe we'll try it with a lure this time Pilot, sit. good he will get the memo that that is what he's trying to do. Pilot. Hey. Down. I really don't want to repeat myself either, just kind of waiting it out. So I do have that tree on the ground, using it as a lure almost for him to almost like lay down and get that treat that's in my hand. Uh -uh. Down. You're okay. Okay. I know. People say hi to, huh? Pilot. Hey. Can you sit? Down. Good boy. Good boy. So I'm just going to end on that down before he gets too flustered. Good boy. Good boy. I know. You want to go say hi? Pilot. Can you sit? Hey. Good boy. We're going to end on that positive note. But he is doing a lot better with a lot of those things. Again, we're going to be practicing that down a little more, especially off of that sit. We have been doing it very well and very consistently, but we do keep our sessions quite short just because we don't want him to be overwhelmed or kind of lose track of what he's learning in the session. So by working on single things, like we've been working on mouthing and jumping, as well as leash walking and all of the other things. But I want to keep this video kind of simple easy for him I don't want him to feel overwhelmed or anything but he is doing much better pilot and just being able to kind of be content by himself with you while you're training he is being a very good boy yes you are and he loves to play with you he's such a snuggly boy huh yes but he's been loving his time here loves to play with his friends pilot good boy and I don't want him to think he needs to jump to get my attention by having him either sit, good boy. I want him to be able to know that he does get my attention when he's kind of being quiet, content, and sitting by himself. Uh -uh. So by just telling him uh -uh, if he's jumping, uh -uh, if he's mouthing, correcting those behaviors, the jumping is that knee up, saying him off and telling him uh-uh. And then the mouthing is just that nice chin chop, especially if he keeps doing it over and over and is consistent with that. We do not want the mouthing. We don't want him accidentally getting riled up and thinking mouthing is okay and then accidentally biting someone. So we just kind of knock that when they first start it. That way they don't continue to do it. Huh, good boy, pilot. Good boy. Uh-uh. Off. So when he sits, that's what I'm going to give him attention. I want him to be kind of content by himself. So waiting for him to sit. Can you sit? Good boy. Good boy. Nice and compact. Good boy. Good boy. Uh-uh. Good. Good boy. 